All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today I'm showing you how you can put emojis into basically any text field, even the server name itself, inside of Discord so you can customize it exactly how you want. And really, all you need is an easy access uh, list of emojis. You can use a website. You can use the emoji keyboard on Windows or Mac, whatever you want to do. And then all you got to do is copy and paste them into the text field. So I've got some basic channels over here, like the general chat channel. And uh, what kind of icon do I want to use for the general chat? You can kind of pick and choose what you're feeling like. Let's go with like an alien. I guess I can't search on this particular website, so I'll just have to peruse until I see something that I actually want to use. So for general chat, let's just use the world icon. There's three different versions, and then I can go into the general. I can edit this, and then I'll put it in the front, because that just feels like where you should put the emojis here to kind of give people a sense of what that's for. Now we're going to want to have like a camera icon, because we're going to do like clips and highlights, right? And that makes the most sense to me. But what would that be under? Objects? Maybe. It looks like here it is. Here's the camera, the film camera. And we'll go over to highlights and edit that. Now, there are different variations of these icons, so some of them might not work as well as others. Like this one is a little bit confusing what that even is. So let's see if this other camera would be better. That's still a little bit difficult to see what that is, but it's a little bit better. It looks kind of like a film camera. And then we want something for the news. And we can even do this, actually, if we go down to the gaming channel, we can even do this, if I copy this game controller, we can even do this inside of voice channels. So I can plunk this at the start. I hit save, and now there's a little joystick next to gaming, but that's kind of, again, a little bit confusing what that object even is. So we might end up wanting one that's a little bit more obvious at first glance. So let's say for gaming, we can use um, this weird alien blaster icon might work. Let's go ahead and edit that. Plunk that in front, and that makes actually a lot more sense. Now there's a little alien blaster before gaming, and we can pick something weird for the AFK channel. And there are some funky emojis out there that I didn't even realize existed. Is there like a sleeping icon, I wonder? You know, just for funsies, let's say that you can use a bathtub because people go AFK to like get a shower sometimes. Uh, and then we'll just paste that there and hit save. And boom, now we've got an AFK channel, some text channels have icons. We're good to go, but you can also put them in the actual server name itself. So if we right click and go to server settings, server profile, we can plunk a weird icon of a wizard here inside the server name and hit save. So now that shows up at the top of the screen here under Night Rain Boogaloo. I can even go into my username and change my display name here from Larry Cobb Chupacabra with a meat after it to some other kind of tasty looking food if I can find the food section. Usually there's a food section, but if I need to, I can just use the Discord uh, library of stuff which is I'm going to have to. Let's go here. Let's go to general. And let's go to emojis. And let's scroll all the way down to food. So I could do like gaming. Gaming's like right here. Although that encompasses way more than I th figured it would. So I'm going to select something from the food category. That's what's uh, jazzing my jazz hands today. And I'm going to go with a hot dog. And I'm going to copy that hot dog. I'm going to go back to my user settings. I'm going to edit my display name. I'm going to put in the hot dog. 
Oh, did that not want to do it? I guess it didn't. All right, maybe I have to actually hit enter on the hot dog. Let's reset that and hit escape. And let's post that. Then we'll copy it again and see if it wants to behave itself this time. User settings, edit display name. There's the hot dog. Perfect. Now I'm Larry with the hot dog. So you can put it pretty much in any text field on here. Messages, private groups for group chats in your private messages section, channel names, server names, usernames. Your world is an emoji oyster. So I hope you found that helpful. I've been your host, Larry. This is how you put different emojis into pretty much any channel name you want. Uh, this is for, you know, pretty much everything. So bye, everybody, and have a good one. And don't forget to do the likey subscribey thing.